accepted. Approach with caution. Hi, I'm Peter Haddock and I'm here with Steve Such, one of the directors here at Lynch Plant Hire. Steve, the last time I saw you were at FutureWorks, we were demonstrating the safety shield system that you had put out there in trial. And today is a very big day for you because you've actually launched this in anger and this safety shield visual digital thumbs up folks is going to be on site. It's a big moment for you, isn't it? Yeah, we're really pleased, Peter. So uh, following those successful trials, uh, we collaborated with uh, John from Safety Shield and John Marley, who is a super lieutenant uh, for SCS down in London. And through a successful trial, we're now pleased to say that we can roll this out within our industry. Now, this was a challenge you had from your supply chain when people like him to say, bring us ideas, you know, show us what we can do differently. Yeah. You know, you're renowned for the thumbs up training. It's all on the stick as you see on your machines. In fact, one of your other directors, Rob Lynch, is currently out on site doing some of that training. Why is it important that you've reacted and done something different? So I think when we talk about collaboration, uh, what we've seen generically is that our Thumbs Up program has been delivered for 10, 15 years. Yeah. So the challenge was from the end user, the client, we need to refresh this. So through our product review groups that we do that you've kindly attended and supported, and by engagement with John from Safety Shield, we sat down in a collaborative way and come up with this, what we believe is a fantastic concept. Why is it a fantastic concept then? And why is it sort of linked to the values that you've just talked about? Yeah, so we're moving in a different world now. Everything is moving towards the digital platform. Um, for me, typically, if I summarise this on a winter's evening at three o'clock, a visual thumbs up from an operator can be perceived or misinterpreted. I think through this system, it now gives us this audible and visual aid. Thumbs up accepted. Approach with caution. To further support when we can encroach on an area in a safe environment. And we always talk about the safety tunnel, folks, when we're on these toolbox talks. I've attended your talks. The safety tunnel is where you should walk down the tunnel towards the operator. And now we've got the safety shield symbol here that actually you can see that uh, illuminated. And in this case, we've got it as a no as go zone because we're in the red zone. Correct. Obviously, the machine is safe. If I give a thumbs up right now. Thumbs up accepted. Approach with caution. I'm at the Approach with caution. I'm at the point now, and on that afternoon at three o'clock in the dark in the pouring rain, where I've given my thumbs up. The actual camera system as well that you're using is, is an AI system from Safety Shield that, that actually recognises that, but it's the driver that has had to hit that button just as we've got in there, and that gives us the audible and the visual, we're good to go. Yeah, really, really good point. So I think what we're really pleased about is that this is a very simplistic com concept. Yep. So from an operator point of view, they simply push a button and it disengages all the levers instantly. It's a secondary device, so we still insist that the dead man's lever has to be isolated. Uh, but again, from a visual point of view, there's not a misinterpretation of whether I can or can't encourage on your area in a safe environment. So what do you think is going to be the impact when you take this to the clients uh, on HS2 in particular? We've seen some really positive uptake actually, certainly from an operator's perspective. Uh, you said we did, um, so that's been a really, really positive. Uh, and I think from uh, raising the bar, which we hear about that terminology consistently in and around Highways England, I'm pretty confident this will be a mandated um, accessory in due course. And I think it really should be because you know we can never do enough for safety yeah. and we can never do enough to make sites really operator safe and operator friendly because fundamentally if there's an accident the operator has got to live with themselves for the rest of their life and nobody wants that on site and it's more sustainable and more fuel efficient folks to have these systems isn't it Steve? Because we don't get a site that's shut down, do we? Yeah, no, we're really pleased. So we're implementing this with 300 of our machines immediately. Wow. So 300 uh, of our 360 machines. We're working closely with Safety Shield on other technology, which I'm sure will come to market later on this year. But yeah, we're really excited by the whole concept. So folks, it's about saying tradition is there with Lynch. We've traditionally had the thumbs up. You're known through it throughout the industry. The new people are coming into the sector, so we've got no, new, young, digital, really in, first people and digital adopters, people that we are desperate to get into this industry. You have a machine control division as well. We do. 
This all links together, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. So I think in due course, we'll see a, a collaborative approach to the technology being combined on many other applications. So we're really excited by the next two years. And don't forget, folks, it's not just diggers and uh, things that Lynch has. You've got a haulage fleet as well, and you've got a whole range of different equipment for different applications. So you will see a lot of shielding going on. You, you know, those 300 units are just the start, folks. Yeah. And it's great to see us taking something from a concept stage, from a conversation stage, into reality on site, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, look, for us, our business, one of our core values is that we listen yeah. uh, and we act upon those kind of communications. So for us, this is a great, great headline. You said we did. Yeah. Operator interaction, client feedback. It's collaboration at its best. And collaboration makes us all safer, makes us go home safely, and makes us a more digitally enabled site. So we have a digital thumbs up now, folks. We have a digitally enabled workforce, and we have a safer site for everyone. Not just the operators, remember, but those people that might not have been around plant as much, and therefore they've got that visual audible aid. And Steve, it's all come from collaboration, from Lynch. Absolutely. And it's great to see, isn't it? Yep, perfect, thank you. Thumbs up, accepted.